Hey everybody. Well, I got this Cooler Master. Cooler Master fan for the CPU. Let's turn it around. Yeah. This is for the Intel i7 core 10th generation. Now, why I bought the fan is because I looked before I uh, made the decision to buy, put a heat seeking fan on it is because I don't trust the water coolers. Because if the, if the pump breaks or something like that, I lost a lot of money. So, no, I didn't. I was close. I was on the edge. I had it really. I ordered it, but then I canceled it for the um, water cooler fan. But it's like, nah, because I want to watch some more YouTube videos. And when I see, when I think of that pump, if that pump broke or some more too broken water leak, uh, I'm not happy. So I just say, fuck it. I'm just going by the old way from back in my days. Use a fan. Use air cool fan. So, you know, it's, it's, it's not the i9, thank God, because I've heard the i9 overheats, but no, I'm gonna stick with the fan. So, let's unbox it. We're gonna unbox it, but I, here's the thing because I like um, the i7 core temp generation is on a 1200 motherboard, so I have to check and see if this is going to fit it. So, you know, so let's unbox it first and, uh, See, because like I said, we gotta, uh, you know, because if it don't fit, then I'm going to have to now then do a hunt, hunt down on what will fit it. Ugh. This is, um, well, yeah, Cooler Masters and it has a LED fan hooked into it. This is the metal part to put it on the metal board. Ooh, a lot of parts. Look at that. A lot of parts. A lot of parts. Brackets and brackets. So let's see what else we got. Here's your fan. Here is your, God, I forgot what we call this. And we hook this fan this to the mother, to the motherboard to get power, to light this light up. This is where you, uh, Put your CPU on and put your uh, thermal paste. I gotta check and see. I hope they put some thermal paste in this. And I think this is. I uh, don't know. I gotta check. I have to check and see what this is. <laughs> Hopefully it is thermal paste. Because if it's not, I'm going to have to buy some. So. so, that's that. But hold on. You have the LED manual. Let's look at it. Oops. There go your brackets.
Let me put that back in the box. So, what I'm finna do now with this is really put this back in the box because the thing is right now is I gotta, like I say, try to see if the brackets will fit a Z420. A Z4... What is it? Z490. Z490 to see if it's going to fit. Which way is this going? Let's see if it's going to fit because if it's not like I'm going to get something else to cool this thing down. So... mess with these brackets hold on okay now I'm gonna screw this in here So you gotta screw it in, it's sticking up. Let me show y'all. See how it's, these things are sticking up? So you gotta screw it right there. See? So you have to screw these. Now, gotta do this side. I know somebody wondering, why did you take the fan off? Well, so let me put this on, this other one on. It's gonna take a second here. Oops. Let's see, I gotta get it where you can get to it. Remember now the fan is in the way. So, boom, we got that hooked up. Now we gotta hook the next thing up. So let me find the screws and stuff to it. Oh, and this will fit the Z490. I checked, now I hope so now. I still gotta put everything together to see if it's gonna fit the 490 motherboard that I have. Okay, so hold on. Hey everybody, well, now this is the bracket Ooh, that goes to it. Now, this side is the Intel side. So, you gotta take, let me show you this screw, see this? And you have to put it, oops, like that. So let me turn it in, Dip. or is it no, it's the other way, hold on. There it go. See it? It slides. And now I gotta put this on it. Let's see. On all four sides. And like I said, we are using uh the, tw the new um, 1200 socket. Hopefully this fan will fit this.
spoon. Let me think. Do we got? I think we got one missing. Oh no, we don't. This is right there. Durr. Yep, there it go. Hold on, let me fix it. Okay, I got it. Okay. Look at that. All four screws. Now let's see if this now let's see what's the next thing. Alright, so now I gotta see will this bracket fit the Z motherboard? Ooh. And it's heavy. <laughs> Let me turn it around. Ooh, and you gotta be careful. Because you can stick your hand. Now realize this is just a test to see if this is going to fit. Okay, so it does fit. It's not locked down though. So it does fit. Ooh, this motherboard. Ooh, it's coming apart though. So it does fit this motherboard. That's good because of the sliding things I put in. So that means the fan, the big fan can fit this 1200 socket. This, uh, the fan is, um, 1155 or 1156 socket. So the 1155 and 1156 socket will fit the Z490. I thought it wasn't, but it did. So now I put all the screws in and everything and put the fan on top of my CPU. And we put it together. And that'll be in a couple of days because uh, we're waiting for the power supply. That has been delayed. <laughs> so... That's what I want to really just try today is to see if it will fit and it does fit all the screws and stuff. So now we just put everything back to back to um back to uh back to normal and stuff. Put everything back. We'll keep these uh screws and stuff together and everything and then when everything comes in we'll just put it together. So that's the uh 
Cooler Master Hyper 12, 12, 212 LED fan with heat sink to go to the uh, Z490 motherboard with the Intel i Core 7 10700K. So, yep, I thought it wasn't going to work, but it worked. So, that's it, y'all.